All right, we're going to work on a little verification of a CNC program using CNC-based software. So if we go to All Programs, scroll down a little bit, find CNC Base, uh, CNC Base for ProLite, and then click on the CNC Base for ProLite 1000. Uh, tool tip, we can just close that out. Um, before we get going too far, there's a few setup things that you're going to need to do. Uh, the first thing you're going to need to do is go to Tools and go to Setup Library. And you're going to need to select tool, I believe we use tool 14. It come down here and call it an end mill. I know it's an engraver, but we'll just go with that. We can leave the teeth and things like that. The rest of it doesn't really matter except for the diameter. Um, this is going to be a really small line. So let's make this thing 50 thou. So 0 0.050 hit apply. See, it puts that tool down in there. Hit OK. So that's the first thing. The next thing will be um, on this little, um, uh, well, this little window or whatever. We have a verify screen right here. Some other things over here. We need to go ahead and um, open up a program. So you'll need to find um, your program. You might have to look around inside of here um, to find it. Locate it. Uh, it might throw, you know, it comes up as .nc. You might need to go all files because you, your file format could be a TXT for the notepad. So go to all files, make sure you find it there, hit open. It'll load this code in. You see how this is all light gray? So this is all light gray it means I can't type inside of here until I go to edit and unlock. Now it's white. That tells me I can go ahead and edit my, my background. All right. Um, up here, we talked about the size of the stock and things like this. I realize it's a different program that we are running, but you, you can get the gist of it. So let's say we got the program loaded in here and we come up here to the verify button. So go ahead and click that. There's a verify program. The first thing before we verify it, to check it out, we need to set the settings of the workpiece. So verify settings, stock. And in this case, your program should be three on the X, right? Y should be two. Uh, the height of the, the stock is 0.25. This is the piece of aluminum that we're using. Um, and you can keep spacer as, as Z, that's fine. Uh, lower left-hand corner was where yours was, so these will remain all zeros. Hit OK. And now you have this guy. And once you have that, you can go ahead and click Verify Program. And if it runs all through it like that, awesome superman life is good um it might prompt you to hit cycle start you kind of have to look up here it might tell you some things on the status line like up here when you're running the program here's your cycle start button here's your stop button so if it's if you're looking for those um those are all options otherwise it's just verify verify program life is good you can edit your program, so maybe it'll say missing numbers. If you look, it'll stop over here. So like, just for example, say I come down here to this line and I have a space right here. So it says X space Y zero. Now watch when I verify the program. That one little thing, missing numbers. Hit okay, the program stops at the line where there's a problem. Take a look at that and say, well, hey, what's the problem here? Oh, I see it, I need to get rid of that. And you get rid of that extra space. It doesn't like that. Cool. Go over here, verify program. Boom, we're good. Um, you might get into an arc like this, and you know your number could be off. This uh, they're using arc centers instead of radiuses. But check this out. Come into here, verify program. Warning: bad arc. So let's just see what it's going to do when I hit cycle start. Warning: bad arc cycle start if I can get it to run it's gonna work out but odds are there's something a little messed up in your code and I'd like to try to figure that out if we can so um, just you know yell at me if we have that situation because if everything is correct you should be able to verify the program run that whole thing and life is good all right um, that's pretty much the quick one two to to do in that um, and uh, if you you know have some problems you know let me know but um, at least that'll get you started uh, while everybody else is still working on some stuff. So again, CNC base um, software verifying your initial uh, CNC program. Thanks. Live the dream.